Sports bettors, what is going on? In today's video, I've got a free pick for you. We are coming off of a nice 2-0 day yesterday. We picked up our free play. We picked up the premium. Uh, free pick was Chicago White Sox. Premium was the Oakland A's on the run line. A's get the job done 6-3. White Sox, I think they won 8-3. That was a no sweat free pick winner for you guys. We've now won two free picks in a row. Um, we had UFC parlay and then the White Sox. And we had a profitable day in the UFC. So if you've been on the premiums, it's been a nice little weekend for us. We're going to continue that through this week. Keep building momentum. Keep building our bankrolls as we approach August. Um, we're about at uh, net zero. I think we've climbed ourselves back up for the month of August. So we had a nice little first few days. We dropped down a bit. We've dug ourselves back up uh, with these last two days. And we're looking to go on a run here. As I mentioned in the last video, there's actually someone out there that documents the wins and losses for all the YouTube handicappers. And I personally love this because it's going to keep all those other guys accountable that don't track their records accurately and don't pay attention. And the guys that really are just putting out random picks, not even betting them, not even tracking them and don't even know if they're profitable or not. Those guys are really getting exposed by this channel. So I will get the name of that channel and I will share it with you guys because they documented like 30 handicappers on YouTube and y'all already know SBE was one of the five or six that was profitable. But it's pretty eye-opening because we all know that 99% of sports bettors lose money long-term. But to see people that actually are putting out advice every single day, uh, you know, you would think more than six out of 30 could pull it off. But it's interesting stuff. So just be careful who you get information from. But hey, I'm not going to tell you guys how to live your life. I'm just thankful you guys are sitting here watching me go through my picks. Um, we will have more NFL preseason. We did win uh, with the Steelers. That was a nice no sweat winner. Cowboys didn't care to win that game. Mike Tomlin and the Steelers, they're playing to win to build momentum. I mean, you saw several of the Steelers' key players, their key receivers out there. I don't know why they were running routes, why they were playing. I would not risk it. I like the Sean McVay approach. I like what the Cowboys did. Some of their star players didn't even suit up. Uh, so you love to see that, and you love to just notice that because we have a bet on team versus a bet against team. Well, we're going to take that all day long. That was an easy winner. Uh, if you are following somebody who said to bet on the Cowboys, unsubscribe from them immediately. Um, but yeah, if you want to hop on the NFL package uh, through the whole month of August, we're doing the early bird special. We will have preseason picks and then we're really going to lay the hammer down once week one gets here and in college football, same thing. Use code early in all caps and you will get 750 bucks off of that all access package. So you're going to get picks literally from this upcoming Thursday's preseason games all the way through the Super Bowl. It's one of the best deals, one of the best promos that I've ran, and I'm living it up all week. Uh, we also have PFL playoffs coming this weekend, so it's going to be a nice weekend in the MMA, even without UFC, which I hate weekends without UFC, but PFL playoffs is going to be sick. I've already dove into that. I actually posted on my personal Instagram a really funny video. Basically, the guy in... So I was sitting like uh, row 12, right? Front and center at, of the octagon. If you guys saw my pictures on Instagram or my thumbnail in a couple videos ago, you would have seen it. But the guy in the row 11 was talking crap to the guy in row 13 about the main event. So we were in Houston, Cyril gone uh, versus Derek Lewis. Everyone in the arena wants Derek Lewis to win, except for me and the dude behind me because we both bet on gone. He has gone inside the distance and then I've gone parlayed up with my free pick and then with a premium. So I'm heavily invested in gone at this point. Um, and anyways, they take a four to one odds live bet after the first round, which I think the guy betting on gone above me is getting the best of this number by far. But it was just funny because he hands me 400 cash. The guy in front of me hands me 100, 100 cash. So I have 500 bucks cash here. Whoever wins, I deliver the money to. Um, it was just hilarious. I recorded it too. I'm going to make a TikTok out of it, but that was just an awesome moment. Um, I'm still living on that high of attending my first UFC pay-per-view. So, uh, anyways, PFL, it will be up on the site soon. It's not up on the site now, but it'll be up on the site soon. If you guys want to hop on that and support me and turn a profit yourself because we've been absolutely killing it in MMA. 
All right, so for your free pick, we're going back to the MLB. Obviously, that's our bread and butter uh, through the months of July and August. And uh, we're going to go with the White Sox on the run line again. A similar number here. They are facing the Minnesota Twins. And I really like Boo Burrows. If you look at his game log, I have it pulled up here in front of me. Let me make sure I get you the exact numbers. But he's an opener, so he, sh he probably isn't expected to pitch deep into this game. But if you look at his last several games, man, against Cincinnati, one inning pitched, one earned run. Against St. Louis, two innings pitched, uh, two earned runs. Against Detroit, three innings pitched, four earned runs. So over his last like nine innings pitched, he's given up nine earned runs. I really love that stat, and I love that the White Sox are playing really well. We get Lucas Giolito on the mound. I think it's another easy, no-sweat winner. White Sox blowout victory. Let's get this money, boys. Let's get this money. I am freaking pumped. I'm going to deliver a ton of fantasy football content to you guys. Premium players, you've already got the email. If anyone hops on late, I will forward it to you immediately. I'm excited, man. This is the best time of the year. Football's right around the corner. Let's go. SBE Nation. I love all you guys, man. I appreciate you guys watching my videos. Um, and I appreciate you know all of your support. Because without you, I, w I literally wouldn't be able to do this right now. I mean... I don't know if I can turn this around, but you know, we're out here, we're studying for uh, PFL and we're studying fantasy football. I mean, this is just awesome, man. I sit in this room all day, every day. I put in the work so that those of you who aren't fortunate enough to have the free time to put in enough research to be profitable, I can help you guys out. So it's truly a privilege to get to do this. I'm grateful for it every single day and I'm working hard for you guys every single day. So Good luck in all your bets. Thanks for watching to the end of this video, and I will see you in it.